Now, Agriculture Cabinet Secretary Peter Munya maintains the ongoing reforms in the tea sub sector are unstoppable. The CS has emphasized that the sole purpose of the reforms is to streamline green leaf collection and curb exploitation of farmers. Speaking this morning, Munya said the reforms will mitigate against declining earnings by the smallholder tea growers. For the last five years, the earnings have been going down, 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 down. What was being done is public relations. In July 2021, a minimum bonus for the last financial year amounting to Kenya shillings 1.3 billion was paid to the small owner tea growers. I remember the previous board refusing to pay, even as we were telling them. I don't know where they wanted to take this 1.3 billion in order to cushion the farmers against the high cost of fertilizer. KTDA, through my ministry, has requested the government of fertilizer subsidy amounting to Kenya shillings, one billion, which will reduce the cost of fertilizer. Even though I've seen that, I would want to make it very clear that this fertilizer was purchased by the board that was there. I don't think these prices, looking at the prices available locally and the price they bought this fertilizer, I don't think the factors we are raising are, well, are the only factors. I think somebody inflated the costs and uh, the investigations are being done by the agents that, the invest, that is doing investigations will also look into this particular purchase. Since the setting up of a minimum reserve price, average tea prices for the small under teas have recorded a 40% increase at the auction. We will work closely with the Minister of Agriculture to ensure a full implementation of the reforms. We want to ensure that the small, small scale farmer get value for their tea they produce. Moving forward, we shall embark on face-to-face -face lead meeting with farmers across the country to hear their grievances and to find out uh, the actual solution to this problem. We want, to, we want a more participatory approach to tea business and not top-down approach as there has been the case.